Hey, hey everyone! Good afternoon! Hello, hello! Happy Sunday! So, um, I thought I would jump on. If you don't know me already, I'm Lisa. I've been able to find a way through sharing makeup and skincare and now the liquid collagen um, to be able to make some extra money from home around my kids and my job and everything. And I thought, why not? Hey, let's come live on a Sunday and do some natural makeup. So, I thought I would show you how I do like a really natural looking glow um, using some of the products that are in our sale at the moment. Um, so I'm going to start off with um, primer. Now I do get asked a lot of the time, um, you know, like what, why do you need a primer? What does it do? And what primer does is it's, the, it's a barrier between your skin and your makeup. And it stops your makeup sinking into your pores. I don't know if you've ever noticed, but you know if you've got dry skin and you put your foundation straight on, you, your makeup tends to cling to the dry areas. So what a primer does, it just supples up your skin before you put your makeup on so that you don't get those like patchy bits, you know, that your makeup stick into. Um, so basically it makes your makeup look better and last longer. So it's a win from me. Um, and we've got quite a few for different skin types as well. So I'm going to go for the mattifying one because um, my skin has been a little bit oily around the T-zone. Um, I, I've got combination skin, so it can be quite difficult. Sometimes I, I need a hydrating primer and sometimes I go for the mattifying one, but it does make a massive difference um, to how fresh and natural your makeup looks. It doesn't look clingy or patchy or weird. Um, now, I'm going to go with the um, BB cream. Now, if you've tried a BB cream, you might be thinking it's like a tinted moisturiser. But the one I use, it's a lot more than a tinted moisturiser. It's much more like a treatment and a foundation, if that makes sense. It's like a lot better coverage than you would get from a tinted moisturiser. Um, let me show you what I mean, because when it goes on, it's just gorgeous. It's like a just proper nice luxury treat for your skin. So it's quite a thicker texture but it's really it feels light on your face it feels like your skin is just having like a drink it's amazing so i'm gonna pop that on let me know if you're watching this on the replay i would absolutely love it if you let me know where you're watching from i love to kind of come back to comments and things like that and see where's everyone been watching from what time it was where you are when you were catching it there we go Like, it just feels like so hydrating for your skin. It's gorgeous. And it just blends so easily. Like it's just one of the easiest foundations to put on. And it's just nice and fresh. Like look how fresh that fresh and natural Sunday vibing this is what I do because you don't always want like a full face of makeup on a Sunday do you you know like if you're just sort of mooching about with the kids and stuff but you just want to look nice this is the one to go for definitely now I'm going to show you a little trick if you feel like you get like dark circles or like you've got bags or puffiness under your eyes quick little trick for that is to get your concealer now, if you're in your 40s, please don't don't be like tempted to do like a full V on your eye because it can just sit in your fine lines and wrinkles. You still want to do the V shape, but just little dots. Less is more if you're like heading for the farty mark or you're past it like me. And then just dab that out and around your eye. Don't try not to sweep when you're doing concealer because what you want to do is keep it in that eye area. You don't want to sort of brush it off. Look how much lighter that looks. <laughs> Just tap that out. Look how nice and fresh that looks. And it's not cloggy. That's the amazing thing. When you just use a little bit, it doesn't sort of sit in your fine lines and wrinkles. It doesn't clog up. And I just feel like it just gives you that lighter kind of fresh look to your face now if you want to add a little bit of glow um i'm going to show you a little trick so 
I'm not gonna lie, the collagen is helping with the glow. I've been taking the collagen for about 60 days now, it's making a massive difference. Um, but if you want to fake a little bit of glow with your makeup, all you need is highlighter and concealer. So I'm gonna grab my um, blush, not, not highlighter and concealer, blush and highlighter. Now, if you get your blush, you just wanna go a little bit higher than you would have in your 20s. This just seems to work and give you like a really natural, fresh vibe. If you just take it a little bit higher. I used to bring it right down the bottom, you know, like in my 20s and there was like a full stripe. But like in my 40s, I'm just finding that this looks more natural. And it just looks like you've been out in the cold or in the sun. Because we're not getting no, we're not getting no sun in, um, we're not getting any sun in England anytime soon, are we? So... Let's just fake it a little bit. So a little bit just on the top of your cheeks. And then the last little touch to get a little bit of sparkle is grab a little bit of highlighter. I use like a feathery kind of brush, quite a soft one, because this means you don't pack it on too heavy. Um, and I'm going to go grab a little bit of highlight and you want to just put it just along the top of your cheekbone. And this is just going to add a little bit of sparkle, you know, when you get under the light. Look at that. Just gives you this healthy glow. Look at that. Little bit of a healthy glow. And it doesn't look like cake to make up. So if you're all about the fresh kind of vibe, this is how I do it. Because you get this nice shimmery glow and it looks so natural so if you if you feel the sunday vibe like me this is my like sunday look um right ladies i don't this is like, like my first time going live on my business page in a while and i'm thinking i might make this like a weekly sunday chill makeup on this page this is going to be the sunday chill um away from all the craziness just some nice natural fresh makeup a bit of adult chat come and see you girls um, and let you know if we've got any like anything on offer or anything like that we've got like a massive sale on our base products at the moment so all the foundations and concealers are on discount at the moment um now i'm going to use a setting spray this is a priming set mist so you can actually use this as your primer and your setting spray it's gorgeous spritz that on and i'm all done have an amazing sunday whatever you're doing and i'll see you soon